Hey, you, hey folks, I'll tell you, I'm so glad to be here tonight. And, and I asked my, my buddies here, I asked my buddies here if they would help me do a, a little song here. Many of y'all remember Larry McPeak, who was one of the original VW boys. I remember 20, how many years ago? 23 years ago, something like that. I got a call one day from Tim, asked me to come to Thomas Jefferson Elementary School that he and Dave Vaught and Larry McPeak had been working on an act. And I took my daughter, who's now a professional dancer in Philadelphia, and my other daughter and my son, and they're spread all over the country. But I took them over to Thomas Jefferson School, and here my three children and I sit there, and they did a part of their act and asked us to write down our thoughts, and we did. And that was the birth of the VW boys. Well, a little time later, I asked Larry, I said, Larry, I wonder what it'd be like if old Barney sat down to write Andy a letter. What would he say? Larry said, I'll think about that thing. And about two weeks later, Tim called me up and said, I got your letter here. Larry finished it. And this is it. It's called A Letter to Andy. I want you to imagine Barney as an older man. And he sits down to write his friend from so many years ago. Dear Andy, you were on my mind today. Thought I'd write you. Don't have much to say. I was just sitting and remembering how things used to be. Me, you, Opie, and B, back in Mayberry. You know, Andy, it, it makes you kind of wonder at just how time caught up to us so fast. Why, just yesterday we was over at Floyd's, stopped by Wally's and got some gas. All that's left are memories of back in Mayberry. I saw some pictures we took out on the lake. You and Miss Helen, lovebirds, no mistake. Oh, and the one that makes me smile of Thelma Lou and me. What wonderful times we had back in Mayberry. Remember, Andy, every Saturday night, here'd come old Lotus, higher than a kite, and the darling boys with sweet Charlene. I wonder whatever happened to Jim Lindsay. I sure miss the times we had back in Mayberry. Well, Andy, it's time to say goodbye I was just kind of lonesome I I hope you don't mind I sure miss you old buddy now things used to be as long as we have our memories there'll be a Mayberry your buddy Barney <laughs> 